The two-step flow theory. It's the idea that information goes through two steps before it influences people. It goes from mass media to opinion leaders, people who are engaged with the media, who interpret it and pass it on to the general population. It's the human centipede of news. Some opinion leaders are obvious. They're the ones that get paid to mouth off. Wait a minute. Others are less obvious but more powerful. See, the two-step flow theory was developed well before social media, before television, really, in the 1940s. Researchers looking into the US election found most voters got their information from other people who read about the candidates in the newspapers rather than directly from the newspapers themselves. They concluded that personal contacts influence voting behaviour more than the media does. Now, the media has changed a lot, but that influence hasn't. Here's a more recent experiment where researchers sent political messages about an upcoming congressional election to 61 million Facebook users and found close friends who shared the message exerted four times more influence on behaviour change than the message itself. If you are a sharer of information, then you are a very powerful opinion leader. and You have more influence than you think. Do you want to add to a world where fake news spreads because people trust their friends too much? If you want to stop the spread of misinformation, then make sure what you post and what you consume, particularly from family and friends, is the real deal.